Yes, my people, we're out here by the, the curry with a, with a taste festival in Zion also. A cloudy weekend brightened up with live music and fresh food. After the COVID-19 pandemic stalled plans to hold the first Curry with the Flavor Festival in 2020, Marilyn Francis with New Orleans nonprofit Friends of Culture helped make it happen this year. A lot of people love curry, and I see a lot of dishes here in New Orleans that the chefs and them add some kind of turmeric curry or something, and I'm like, well, we from the Caribbean, and we use this curry, so why just don't bring a curry fest and see how it's going to take off, and today, here we go. Alin Easton flew in from Michigan to support her friend, who's better known in the community as DJ Lady Pepper Tree. Now, though she'd been on her feet all afternoon serving patrons, Easton said she's been enjoying the festival. The music's been great. Um, everybody, of course, is friendly. It's like a small community, right? And so, and very welcoming to all. You cannot beat the food. You just can't beat it. One person who's serving here today introduced me to some traditional Caribbean dishes, all prepared by DJ Lady Pepper Tree this morning before the festival. Right here I have a sampler plate of everything that hasn't already sold out yet. Curry chicken, curry goat, curry shrimp, beans and rice, and spinach rice as sides. I also have a tray of the traditional Trinidadian snack, bowl of with some pineapple chutney on the side. DJ Lady Pepper Tree says her LCMC co-workers can't get enough of her homemade meals. And bringing them plates each week fuels her dream of opening up an authentic Caribbean restaurant in New Orleans. And in the meantime... Next year, same time, we have the same thing out here. Come and enjoy yourself. 